Hello, Earthlings, and we're back with more Bioshock. Of course, uh, we just gotta continue forward now. Oh, we're out, we're full with pistol rounds. I think I know what I gotta do here. Oh, wait. Nice. We always get some pretty decent rewards from the from the chest, so it's always good to pick them up, you know. She cuts me into a thousand beautiful. Oh. All right. Yeah, I do enjoy uh, how the hacking mechanic is. I think it's really fun. However, I think there is sort of a flaw with the hacking mechanic, which is uh, that sometimes it's like physically impossible to do it. And I think the fact that there it can be impossible makes it like But like what I was gonna say is uh the hacking mechanic, it's really fun how it works. However, it is possible to have like a layout because it's entirely random where everything is. It's entirely possible to have one of those hacks be impossible and you have to try it again to see, okay, is this the one where I can actually do it? And though it's really fun, it's a major gripe of mine that is like one of the only things that actually puts this game down for me. It's just you. All right, and with that, we 
here's another thing with Bioshock. You can actually choose to save or harvest the little sisters. Uh, and as you can see on screen, uh, it actually shows you the pros and cons. Uh, you can get a lot of Adam from harvesting, but the child will not survive. But if you rescue her, you get less of the Adam, but you get some reward. Now, of course, I feel like the right answer here is obviously no, to rescue. No, no, no. Thank you. Thank you. The path of the righteous is not always easy. Yes, the reward will become clear in time. Be patient. Tenenbaum's playing you for a sap. Those things may look like wee little girls, but looks don't make it so. You need all the atoms you can get to survive. If you cross paths with another of them, Yeah. So you can see what we can get here. And we can immediately get a health upgrade, which is really nice. You can also get these, which is pretty good. Uh, I am actually going to start with a health upgrade. Because more health is always beneficial. Oh, and here's actually director's commentary. Uh, it's basically for the actual commentary in the game. I just think it's pretty cool that they actually have that in the game. Uh, I love when there is director's commentary. Alright. Yeah, we have to actually fight the big daddy now. That's how you do it. No, no. Just like that. <laughs> and of course, now I'm out of armor piercing rounds. That's unfortunate. Let's do this. Let's go. Let's go to Neptune. Now you have the pleasure of Andrew Ryan's company. He's the one who built this place, and he's the one who ran it into the ground. Nobody knows exactly what happened. Maybe he went mad. Maybe the power got to him. Maybe he just decided he didn't like people. Whichever way you slice it, good man died. Me family's in a submarine hidden in the foundation of Fontaine Fisheries. I'll meet you there. All right. It's always good to look around. Oh, yeah, and here's where you would actually uh, swap your things. But, of course... Uh, as you can see, obviously, there isn't a whole lot that we have in the first place. Ooh, okay, we can actually hack. So let's hack this. All right. So now we have armor piercing rounds again, which is always good to have. And you can see that there are three little sisters in this level. Which is, like, important to, to know, because you're going to have to get them.
All right. Days go by like wind. And just no. like that, we've already saved no. another one. No. You have shown kindness to my little one, but are you really a friend to us? Regardless, a little one brings you a gift to demonstrate our appreciation. And with that, we already, yeah, we already see that we're getting a reward for actually saving them. So. Keep that in mind, it's actually beneficial to save them rather than to, uh, there is, like, a benefit to actually saving them, is what I mean. Oh, huh. And that strengthens our medical attackers. Oh, here's the gift. And we can get another plasmid slot. And let's also get... I'm trying to think. Let's upgrade health and let's upgrade our Eve. I think that'll be good. Now let's go here. Oh, that was just barely possible. And got it. All right. Oh, wait, we have to go this way. Okay, I, I entirely missed where I was supposed to go. And we just gotta go in here. Knock on the door. Atlas would break you down ahead. Says you were looking for an invite to the fisheries. That's what I say. But if you head up to the Warp Master's office and find old Peach a research camera, maybe I could manage an invite. All right. Well, what was that? All right. Look on the back of your belt. You'll find something to keep you alive. Now, go 
Look at that camera. Ooh. And snapshots of those that crawls on the ceiling. Then I'll let you into the fisheries. All right. Remember, sorry friend. I smell an ounce of Fontaine on you, and I'll have you in a box. I just give you the vouch, but I ain't turning my eye just on his say so. Yeah, so that's another weapon. All right. Yeah, so there's definitely a lot of stuff going on, I guess is the best way of putting it. But it's always nice to take a little look around, see what's all around, you know? Ooh, some mines. And yeah. <laughs> All right, and that's another one of the little sisters saved. We keep saving them because that's what we do. So I can't hack that, so that's not good. Welcome to the circus of value. <laughs> All right. And just up here. The research camera looks just like what you'd see topside. According to this magazine article I scrounged up, it can also analyze genetic information, biological structures, and lots of other five dollar words. All right. Now that that's done, I can go down here. Grab more of this and just seemingly proceed forward. Jesus loves me, this I know. All right. Can we take pictures of the same one? No, it's got to be other ones. All right. I'm really playing recklessly with all of this, all things considered, since I am looking for the, uh, the what is it? Uh, the, the spider slicers. Surface exposes rapture to the very parasites we fled from. You stretch the necks or a small price to pay for our ideals. We tricked you, monster. You have to fight me, monster. Are you afraid of me, monster? Oh, that's a good shot. All right. And what's just beyond here? Oh. Hmm. 
money. All right. We're still looking for the, the, the things that we need. Got it. Got it. Mr. Coswell? Oh, and look at that. There's a big daddy out there. Alright, thing is, we're still looking for one more picture of a spider slicer. There we go. Here to visit the scum of the earth. And we got the last one. this area. Nice. Alright, and with that out of the way, we can feel free to just continue back to Fontaine's Fisheries, it appears. Silverware in the like. 
All right, let me in. Let me in. Before you head into the fisheries, a word to the wise. All PGs is about as straight as a dog's hind leg. You keep your eyes open. Nobody walks into my swampy carry a night. Put your weapons in the new home, and I'll let you in. All right. Oh, wait. Huh. Oh, there it is. That's pretty nice. Alright, welcome to the ice world. Oh. It is very difficult to see. Oh, we got pistol rounds, which means we got another pistol. How funny. I, I love how things like that turn out. That aside, we can definitely look around now. Of course, it's, it's always good to look around. That is an undeniable fact. Yeah, this game feels really solid, like playing it again. Like, you move really fast, and that's really nice. Alright, just down here. I love the little effects that the hand has as well. It, it, yet again, it's really nice. Oh, wait. Yeah, we get all our weapons back. Ooh, okay. And here's actually a weapon upgrade station. Uh, and I think, uh, strategically speaking here, Let's increase the damage of the machine gun as that will increase armor piercing rounds damage. And that'll be pretty nice. Oh, there.
All right, that is another save hacked. Nice. Oh. You can't quit, Fontaine. My... You don't fuck Fontaine. Fontaine fucks you. Oh, here's another one of the director's commentaries. Pretty nice. Anyway, just continuing forward now. Oh, loading screen. Interesting, interesting. And we're now in the smuggler's hideout. Oh. Another gene bank. Another one of those. We all come down here. Oh, shotgun. Great. Oh, yes. He's up in Fort Frolic banging fashion models. We're down in this dump yanking guts out of fish. Fontaine's promising something better. He's like a, one of us, you know? Like he's worked the day in his life. He says meet him at his fish packing joint at 11. I'll go, bring a couple of guys. Hey, <laughs> it's not like things could get a lot. Hit the switch up there in the control booth and let me in. I think it's time to shake hands and get acquainted. All right. You had your fun, but enough is enough. If you press that button, you'll learn what it means to truly be my enemy. All right, and here we are. His family's in there. Let's save it. All right. Gotta, of course, loot the bodies. Well, that's unfortunate. You 
moves in like an assassin, and then you try to sneak out like a thief. You're no CIA spook. Who are you? Why have you come here? There's two ways to deal with a mystery. Uncover it. And we're now entering Arcadia.